Hi, Sophia Cooper, the head of the Saratoga High School Events Commission. We're here on Earth Day at the Alternative Energy Fuel and Food Fair. We have a bunch of really fun companies that participated today. Thanks, Sophia. We were able to talk to representatives from some of the companies attending the evening portion of the fair. The first representative we spoke to was Greg Renda from Tesla. Hi, I'm Greg Renda with Tesla Motors. This is our uh, Tesla Roadster, our 2010 Tesla Roadster. It's a uh, fully electric, goes at zero to 60 in 3.7 seconds, and you can get about 250 miles on a single charge. We'll charge up in your garage overnight, never have to go to a gas station. One of the things our customers complain about is their windshields stay dirty all the time because they never go to the gas station. About it. We were also able to talk to Chris, a representative from SET Solar Corporation, about what his company does. What does your company do? Uh, right now we manufacture uh, solar panels. Uh, we're a vertically integrated company that uh, does everything from the raw materials to um, the final end product that you see here. Um, and basically what we do here in the U.S. is just marketing and sales, so we sell primarily business to business. Um, but uh, we do work with installers to uh, um, you know, also find accounts for residential and actually do the build-ins uh, um, you know, for the customers. So kind of all aspects of the industry where we kind of have our hands in, yeah. We also spoke to Kevin, a representative from the electric bike companies that attended the fair. This is an electric bike and uh, the way it works is that back here there's a motor and uh, as you pedal, uh, it automatically kicks in to make it so that it's easier for you to pedal. And then it's all powered by a battery that's here. This is a lithium ion battery. And the way it works is, you know, each charge will allow you to go for maybe 20 odd miles. Uh, but at night you would just take it out and take it home and plug it into a normal wall socket. Uh, so this is really an alternative um, to a bike bicycle wow. or potentially a uh, 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 motorized vehicle. We were also able to speak to Tick Yip, the vice president of Silo Inc., about how his product works. Hi, I'm Tick Yip with Silo Inc. I'm the vice president of the company. And uh, Silo Inc. is a completely sustainable inkjet uh, cartridge company. Uh, what we do is instead of throwing away empty cartridges, uh, we've created a system that basically, you know, you can, it refills the cartridge themselves. It's called a continuous ink system. And it contains about 10 times as much ink as a regular cartridge. So if you have a six color printer, you have 60 cartridges worth of ink at your fingertips. Uh, since you're buying so much ink to begin with, we're able to give you a substantial saving versus buying individual ink cartridges. In fact, you get probably about 80% savings versus buying cartridges from one of the major brands. Three Prong Powers representative, Paul Guzik, also spoke to us about how their product works. Hi, I'm uh, Paul Guzik with Three Prong Power. We're based in Berkeley, California. What we do is offer a plug-in upgrade to the Toyota Prius. So you take a standard Prius, we install this battery pack system charging plug and you can drive on electricity as well as gasoline. We don't remove anything from the car so you can actually drive uh, pure electric anywhere from 10 to 40 miles depending how much battery we put in or go in blended mode and get 80 to 100 miles per gallon. Um, our system started around $3,500 and our maximum system is around 13,000 and that will give you a 40 mile all electric range. We also spoke to Sam Fankuchen, the marketing manager from Lexus of Stevens Creek, about the cars he brought to Eighth. Sure. I just came with a couple of the cars here today. We've got the RX 450H on this side and behind us the brand new HS 250H, both of which are hybrids. There are two of the hybrids, the four that we currently sell, and we're rolling out a fifth that's gonna come out sometime between the end of summer and Christmas, called the CT200H, which will also be relatively inexpensive, look sort of like this one, have some of the same design language, but be a little bit sportier and, and be a hatchback. So we've been selling full hybrid cars, meaning you can also operate them in full electric mode or gas mode, as opposed to mild hybrid cars like uh, you know, for instance, the Ford Fusion that was here and some of the others, which can use both simultaneously, but only the gasoline engine exclusively. So we, uh, these are powered by the Toyota Hybrid Synergy Drive System, 
which is the only fully hybrid system that you can get on commercial cars. And we've been selling them for a very long time and have a very full lineup. And so it's fun to come out here and look at everything else that's new, because these are all really cool. And sort of look at where our roots were and, and where we're going. And this is technology that's available today. And for a really low price point, something like this, um, I'm not legally allowed to say what our current pricing is because it could change, but it's extremely low. And when you factor in how much money you're saving on gas, it ends up being about the least expensive new car you can get. So it's, it's nice to be able to have all that technology and capability every price range. We leave you with some of the company's thoughts about the fair. And a final word from Sophia Cooper. This is Ken Paisley. Thank you for watching our video on the Alternative Energy Fuel and Food Fair. Uh, the fair is pretty interesting. I, I like the motorized bikes. Um, seems like everyone loves Tesla. Um, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Pretty interesting. Um, sure. Cool I love the bikes because I went to Stanford also. So it was nice, <laughs> nice for me to see those guys here and sort of uh, catch up with them. And I love ideas that are coming from students. I mean, sort of the heart and soul of innovation around here, right? Yeah. Is everything that's coming out from the school. So to see five of them show up with two different prototypes is very, very fun to be around. A lot of fun as well. Look forward to a lot of fun things next year because it'll just keep getting bigger. Driving off, Sophia Cooper.